Welcome back to True Host Academy. Today we're diving into something super important for anyone managing a website, installing cPanel on a VPS. If you're looking to take control of your web hosting, cPanel is the ultimate tool to help you do just that. Truehost.com offers optional cPanel with their VPS packages. Now in case you find yourself with a VPS package that doesn't have the cPanel option, you can always install it manually. Let's get started. Alright, so you've got your VPS and you're ready to install cPanel. But before we jump into the installation process, let's quickly cover what you need to get started. First things first, make sure your VPS meets the minimum server requirements. You'll need at least 1 GB of RAM, though 2 GB is better, a minimum of 1 CPU core, and around 20 GB of disk space. Plus, you'll need a supported operating system like CentOS, Alma Linux, or Rocky Linux. And don't forget, you need SSH access with root privileges to install cPanel. Panel. Before we install cPanel, we need to prepare the server. Think of this as setting the stage for a smooth installation. Update the server. Keep your server up to date. Run this command, yum update yy, or if you're using a system with DNF, DNF update yy. Set a host name. Next, set a host name using an FQDN. Here's how you do it. Host and name CTL set host and name server.example.com. Replace server.example.com with your desired host and name. Disable Selenix. Finally, let's disable Selenix to avoid conflicts during the installation. Set Enforce 0 to permanently disable it. Edit the Selenix config file and set Selenix equal sign disabled. Now we're ready to install cPanel. Follow these steps carefully. Download the cPanel installation script. First, download the latest installation script. Run this command cd slash home and uncurl o latest https colon slash slash secure downloads dot cpanel dot net slash latest. To run the installation script. Once downloaded, execute the script to start the installation. As she latest, this process will take a bit of time, so grab a coffee while it installs. With cPanel installed, let's wrap up with the initial setup and configuration. Access WHM, log into your web host manager, WHM, using this URL https colon slash slash your underscore vps underscore ip 2087 use your root username and password complete initial setup follow the setup wizard to configure basic settings like your email address host name and name servers and that's it you've successfully installed cpanel on your vps now you're ready to start managing your websites domains and more all from a user-friendly interface if you found this video helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe for more tutorials see you in the next video thanks for watching true host academy if you have any questions or run into any issues drop them in the comments below we're here to help Happy hosting!